Good morning, everyone, and happy Sunday. I am starting off this vlog a little bit later in the day. It's almost one o'clock. Normally, if I'm vlogging, I try to start in the morning, but this morning was really relaxing and I wasn't quite ready to pick up the camera. Um, so we're shutting it out. But pretty much this morning, I read for a little bit. I'm currently reading Love and Gelato, which is super, super cute. I think I'm gonna finish it tonight. Um, but I read a little bit and then I went to Orange Theory. I had a great workout. I burned about 600 calories, freaking nailed it, loved it. Um, and then I took a shower and now we're here and I'm drinking my second cup of coffee for the day. Today I have um, kind of like some fun stuff planned. Uh, we are going to be going to put up wallpaper, um, which I initially filmed a vlog about this and then I didn't end up posting it, but pretty much we've been renovating our um, bathroom, which if you follow me on Instagram, if you don't, you should, um, but I kind of updated a little bit more there. And so we've been renovating our bathroom. Finally, the wallpaper came in and I'm so, so excited because once we put the wallpaper up, we can then put our towel racks up, which I'm really excited about. Um, if you've ever done home renovations, you would know that like having things in disarray just isn't the vibe. Um, and it's in, been in disarray for about three weeks now. So I'm really excited to like get the wallpaper up, order the towel racks, and kind of feel like a sense of normalcy in the bathroom because it's definitely been a little crazy um, since we started about three weeks ago. So we're gonna do that today and then later I'm going to the bookstore because I need to get some more books. I've been super into reading lately. If you guys haven't been able to notice on this channel, I've been, I don't know, I used to love reading all the time and then I got out of it for so, so long and now I'm like back into it full swing and I'm just, loving it and i've been sharing it here on this channel just because it's something i'm passionate about but yeah we're gonna go to the bookstore which is gonna be really fun get a lot of books that are on my august tbr if you guys watch that video and that's gonna sort of be the day it's gonna be like a fun lazy not lazy it's gonna be like a fun like getting my life together sort of sunday which we love so let's go ahead and get into it Okay, so I'm headed to the store to find a gold light fixture. Um, essentially, like, we are now at the part of the wall where we have to take the lights off so the bathroom is very dark. And I kind of don't want to, um, like, have to, like, put this old light fixture on and then later on have to take it back off. Like, it's just easier to do it now and so i'm gonna run to the store and see if i can find something last time i went to home depot they didn't have a lot of gold light fixtures so i'm hoping there's an, a new one there now but if not um i also have a lowe's across town so let's go and while i'm doing that trey's plugging it that's great I'm heading back out. I sat down for a little bit and just relaxed because I was exhausted. I went ahead and bought a light fixture online, so that should be coming in Tuesday. Um, so hopefully we don't go too long without lights in the bathroom. I am swinging by Barnes & Noble real quick. Um, they close in literally 40 minutes, so this isn't as quite of a relaxing like a bookstore trip as I wanted it to be, but like tis life you know what i mean um so yes but i thought i'd bring you guys with me because i do want to grab a couple books from my tbr i don't know why i said that so weird i want to grab a couple books from my tbr So it's like 8 30 at night trey and i had pizza for dinner it was kind of like a wine and pizza sort of night because honestly i'm exhausted he went to go play basketball which i don't even know how because like i'm so tired but that's what he likes to do he likes to play basketball with his friends this is one of their last couple games that they have together so like bye anyways so i thought i'd show you guys what i got from the bookstore um i'm a little disappointed because i 
feel like my Barnes and Noble does not carry a lot of books and so I did not find a lot of the books that I was wanting to get but I did get a couple that were on my TBR so we're gonna go through that really quick oh I'm drinking Pinot Noir by Acrobat 2018 it's so good it's so good if you have not had Acrobat Pinot Noir I highly recommend it you can probably see all the rolls of wallpaper behind me that we had to put up tomorrow <clears throat> so anyways okay let's get into it so first i picked up malibu rising this is by taylor jenkins reed this is by the same person who wrote the seven husbands of evelyn hugo and i absolutely adore that book um that was one of my very first five stars of this year so i figured i'd pick up another book from her um from my understanding the synopsis is like about an annual end of the summer party and it gets out of control and um I don't really know it's about an unforgettable mind we'll see um so that's the first thing i picked up the second book i picked up i picked up three by the way the second book i picked up was the unhoneymooners um this is by christina lauren this i've seen all over booktube book talk um it's a romantic comedy which i don't read a lot of romance i'm a big thriller girly especially suburban thriller um but I don't want to like just stick to one genre I'm really trying to like open my palette um and so I wanted to incorporate romance and a romantic comedy seemed to be the perfect way to do that and this is so highly spoken of um so I figured I'd pick this one up uh essentially it's about uh, a girl who goes to her friend's wedding and then they the, everybody in the wedding party gets sick except for her and I think he's the um the best man and so they have to go to this honeymoon because it's non-refundable um and yeah so we'll see we'll see what it's about i think it's really cute i'm trying to make sure i incorporate as much beach reading as i can while I, it's still summer so um this seemed like a really good addition and then last but certainly not least was a court of wings and roses by sarah oh wait a court of wings and ruin by sarah j moss so this is the third book in the akatar series i just finished a court of mist and fury and which is the second book i freaking loved that book i freaking love the book but the thing about sarah j moss is that her books are thick with like c's so a Court of Mist and Fury was 650 pages. This book is 703. Like, this is some Harry Potter level shit. So, um, <laughs> I took a break after reading A Court of Mist and Fury, and I read Love and Gelato, which is what I'm currently reading and what I'm probably going to read tonight. Um, I'm almost done with it because I feel like I needed a palate cleanser after reading so much of a mystical world. Like, it's like... 650 pages is like two books <laughs> like standard books you know what i mean so um so i did pick up the third book i do not plan on reading the third book immediately um i think what i'm gonna do is i think tonight for the rest of the evening to sort of like wind down because honestly i'm just feeling like ah, from all the wallpaper it literally took up our whole day literally the whole day like what so i think to kind of come down from the evening i'm gonna drink my glass of wine i'm going to probably finish love and gelato and if i finish it i potentially might start the unhoneymooners um because i've actually been um like scheduling my own honeymoon lately we just i haven't even like filled you guys in on wedding stuff like oh my god okay so we have we have booked our honeymoon officially as of two days ago we are so excited i don't know if i'm gonna like share it with you guys where we're going because i don't know it feels a little weird to share it but we have booked our honeymoon we're gonna be taking it two weeks and it's gonna be in like a beachy environment i'm so so excited oh my god i'm so excited so it seems kind of like relevant to like read about honeymoon stuff since we just booked our honeymoon um and i'm i'm so excited you guys like i i i just feel like with covid and everything going on trey and i have not really had the opportunity to travel or do a lot of the fun things that i would love to do in the honeymoon phase of a relationship and um booking our honeymoon for two weeks just felt like oh my god just like amazing so 
Anyways, um, that's what I'm gonna do. Finish this, potentially read this next, hang on to this, um, and then go from there. Alrighty guys, it is 9.45 and I'm still reading this book, but I'm gonna start my night routine and my night routine is pretty awesome if I do say so myself. Um, I'll share it sometime, but I'm gonna start my night routine and like get into bed and relax. So that's gonna be it for today's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It's been a minute, I feel like, since I've vlogged, so I hope this turns out okay. There was a lot of sweat, tears, and frustration that happened in that bathroom today with the wallpaper, so hopefully that turned out okay but anyways um thank you guys so much for watching if you're still here um please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it leave a comment below what you did this weekend and i will talk to you guys in another video bye